Press escape. Look, a perfectly functioning menu. Boring. Functionality, we can't have that around here. I'm gonna do all I can to make this GUI as inconvenient as possible. I'm a modder and it's time to change the dynamic from pressing the menu's buttons to the menu pressing your buttons. Alright, here's the deal. I'm new to all this GUI stuff, but by the end of this, I have a goal. You see, everything here is made up of buttons or sliders. Ooh, 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 ooh. What I want to do is add a new gizmo that is literally just a hand crank. And so to change this value, you actually have to uh, 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 spin it around. But let's start off with something simple. For example, sliders. I want to be able to drag this outside of its bounds. So uh, turns out that was incredibly simple. And my game crashed. All right, let's try that again. Let's go this way instead. Oh my, I, I don't know what to call this, but it's beautiful. All right, all right, ready, ready? I'm gonna look down, boom. <laughs> this is insane. It feels like I'm going off into space when I jump. When I fly, it's back to normal. Never mind, it's upside down. Let's see, what else can we mess with? Uh, oh, we have a lot. So I can take brightness and just turn that all the way up. And this pretty much just gives us full bright, nothing too crazy. However, what happens if we take that and turn it all the way down into the negatives? Oh yeah, hmm. Is this like the same as zero? Yeah, I think so. All right, so this is an enchanted golden apple with normal settings, but if we turn glint speed all the way up, and glint strength all the way up. That looks like a clickbait golden apple. But let's go further. 600% beautiful. I don't know if these are enchanted books anymore or Lego light bricks. Huh, it's actually not that bad when you wear it. I can also set entity distance to 0% and now I can't see any of the mobs in the world. I can't even hit them. Let's see, what else? Ooh, I could turn volume all the way up. I mean, it's loud, but... It's not base boosted. I can also set the damage tilt to a crazy high number. What the heck? When this guy hits me, I'm gonna do a barrel roll. That's enough messing around with sliders. For my next trick, I wanna make all the buttons run away from your mouse. Thing is, I don't know if this will work, so the first thing I should do is get these buttons to actually move. All right, let's see if it works. Yes, okay, let's go. And I can't do anything now. Okay, I got sidetracked, but trust me, you're gonna like this. Earthquake buttons. Let's see if I can navigate this. Options, video set, oh no, no. Vi video settings, there we go. Even the recipe book is having some fun. I may have gotten it, let's see. Never mind. what? Attempt number two. Okay, <laughs> it follows my mouse, but I'm getting there, I'm getting there. Third time's a charm, let's see. Yes! Oh my gosh, it's beautiful. Statistics, let me let me get statistics. Hey, come back here. Eh, got him. Oh, and uh cool. Now I can't leave this menu. Alright, hear me out. What if when you finally catch these buttons, they don't stop running from you because they spawn into the world and literally run away from you? I got a model whipped up, now time to code. So far I have registered the entity. Let's see if it actually renders. Yes, perfect. It's missing something though. There we go. Now let's get this guy to run around. All right, you ready to run? Let's see. Mm, not fast enough. But what are you doing? Hello? This may be faster, but I think it works now. Anyways, our dear friend is currently looking like a blank slate. Time to add some writing. Hmm, seems like the text is not rendering. Never mind. Attempt two and that is so much better. The text here is actually a bit of data, so I can change it to whatever I want. I can also make the text very long and it won't spill outside of the button. But how would I spawn in? Great question button. I'll have to make it so that when I click one of these buttons, they get removed and appear in the Minecraft world. Why aren't the buttons running away from your mouse? Uh, cause it'd be annoying. I have to hold shift now for it to work. Any other questions? All right, no more questions. The first step has been taken. When I hold control and click these buttons, they disappear. Looks like I'm out of options. Attempt number one. That, that kind of worked. Just the text is not set. Attempt number two. And it works. Awesome. I just spawned in all my video settings. I feel like there's only one last interesting thing we can do with these guys, and that's to let you breed them. <laughs> Here's something that took me five minutes to make. Desaturate that subscribe button. Come on, come on, do it. I, I spent time to make this. You, you really should.
All right, I'm doing what I promised at the start of this video. It's time to make that hand crank. So far, I have it rendering, and it even spins, which took a bit of math. But right now, it does nothing. I can click it. That's, that's really it. Kind of looks like the world's most disappointing fidget spinner. In case you're wondering, this is what a whole grid of these looks like. It's actually really satisfying. Now that little knob on the crank actually is highlighted when I hover over it. And now I've made it rotate only when you're clicking on it. I'm pretty much almost done with this, and it's been quite easy. Who would have thought that the hardest part of doing some things is actually getting yourself to do it? So I have it tracking the angle change. Let's see if it works as I spin it all the way around. Oh my goodness, it keeps counting. Yes! Great news, it works. It, like, actually works. Check this out. Eh, 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 eh. I gotta spin this so many times just to slowly increase my FOV. Alright, you know what? This is too much. Back down. That's it, I've done it. I improved Minecraft's GUI. I just want to say- wait, actually, I should zoom in for this. I just want to say this was quite the entertaining experiment. Alright, now to zoom out again. Wait, come back, come back! No!